Hi, I'm Jackie and Jacob with The Scoop, and I'm here with Wendy Sue Swanson, who's an amazing blogger, and we'll be speaking later today. And so I was wondering what inspired you to start your Seattle Mama Doc blog? Well, you know, it, it really came out of understanding that I didn't feel like I was serving patients and families like I needed to, that I'd taken an oath. And mm -hmm. uh, when I started practicing medicine about eight years ago, I'd get into clinic and families would come in with lots of myth. Now, that was mm -hmm. the beginning of great content online. But I started to realize that the time I had with patients and families in the exam space just wasn't enough time to share the kind of access I had to good information and yeah. expertise. So that was the beginning. That was five years ago. Mm -hmm. I've now written about 520 posts yeah. and um, written a book and done some all these other things but and now we run a team in innovation because of learning yeah. that social tools have this exceptional power mm -hmm. of using one-to-many communication to get the word out and I, I want to give it to all sorts of other people yeah so you're really into social media so I have to ask what's your favorite social media platform well, it varies. Uh, personally, I love Instagram. Mm -hmm. uh, it's clean. It's fun. It takes something that doesn't look very good and makes it feel really emotional. Yeah. Uh, and I generally go to it when I want to break. Mm -hmm. uh, but when I think about my role as a pediatric advocate online, uh, I love Facebook. You know, 8 yeah. o'clock rolls around, people get their kids to bed, and they peruse Facebook. Yeah. And so for me, it's a great way to say, hey, I heard about this information today. Um, here's a new study that's come out. Or, gosh, did you hear about the environmental working group's concern about eating cereal? Mm -hmm. And I can hopefully do a little bit of myth busting yeah. and also do a little bit of engagement to say, you know, I'm not that worried about this. You don't probably need a daily vitamin for your kid. You might need some vitamin D. But yeah. chill out and get back to whole food and calm people down and mm -hmm. you know parents really want to do the right thing yeah and I've got all these tools now in my hands instead of seeing a patient one at a time um, and instead of listening one at a time yeah I can just look at my feed and listen to all these incredible people like you who yeah. I follow on Twitter and think about like what are people trying to do how are people hacking into these solutions and how are patients and families getting the answers they need and how can I take what they're doing on the outside and now in this team and in innovation at Seattle Children's how can I bring that into the hospital environment yeah. that's it's a really hard place to change and that's really yeah. galvanized and structured and how can we be more nimble and more creative and and as I like to say act more like willow trees yeah oak trees so on Twitter what is your favorite hashtag you know in the very beginning of my work when it was a smaller community I used um, Dana Lewis's healthcare social media yeah. whenever I'm talking about something that I think is relevant for education I use hashtag med ed mm -hmm. uh, I, I started using hashtag work life balance a few years ago when I would yeah. start writing about my life as a physician raising my kids mm -hmm. what piece of advice would you have for someone who wants to start out in the social healthcare space well I think you should lurk I don't think you need to push a lot of content. I think you should listen. You should look at the people you don't like as much as you look at the people that you do. Figure mm -hmm. out what it is that they do that captures attention. What is it that they do that you like and respect? And what do people do that you don't? So mm -hmm. that as you start to create your fingerprint, your yeah. digital footprint, how can you be really true to what your mission is, what problem you're trying to solve, and, and kind of steal from others' great success of either yeah. getting a lot of attention for being a moron or getting a lot of attention for doing something extraordinary yeah awesome well thank you so much for taking the time you're welcome it's fun with the scoop i'm jackie andreka